they, I'm pretty sure they told me to do a summer cut. But he said, don't do a summer cut this time. Do a, he said, don't skin her. But this is all pretty tangled up in here. He said, she's not matted, but it is pretty tangled in here. So we might just, I'm not sure what I want to do. We might tighten everything up. Or we might do a two guard all over, I'm not sure. This poop stuff has to come out. Alright? Oh, I got the table so low. You got an extra battery? Yeah. Oh, wait. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go it. Oh, wait.
ideal. This is not the best, but we'll fix it all after towards the end.
dog doesn't have to undergo the, all the brushing all at one time. Those fat lips. She's thinking the fat lips? Yep, those fat lips. So how could you really, really use that? So I always move it out of my way. 
that's why you'll see I actually have another brand. It doesn't have that in the way now. I have it in my salon online store. So I still use these where I, I am very comfortable with them, but I always move this piece out of the way. It just keeps slipping back in my way and I just move it right out. But the one online, you'll see it doesn't have that. The one I sell now. And then if you've ordered these, you'll know this spring right here. If you leave it open, never leave them open. This spring will just pop right out and you're screwed. You're doing it in the grass, it's in the grass somewhere. I don't I didn't like that about these either. Kind of letting her help me give her help let her give her arm to me. Don't get mad, you got my arm right there. I know you're licking it, but don't bite it, okay? Let me see, your nails are pretty long. She's an older girl, so you gotta take care of her. I know, don't get mad at me. I know you got my arm there. I know I'm right at the vein. I know what I'm looking for. I know what I'm doing. Yes, I do. We've done this before. pretty long. Huh? They got really long. Yeah, very. We would have groomed her sooner if she wasn't feeling good. Your dog's not feeling good, don't be grooming it. Give her some time, give him some time to recover. doing a two guard all over so all righty she did so great she did so great yeah, yeah, yeah. hey you guys
guys, it's Dee Dee Croy with My Favorite Groomer on YouTube. All right, so we have some uh, really cool news that I want to share with it, it with you. Okay, so uh, for those of you who I'm emailing, talking to, and you are near Las Vegas, so June 25th, 6th, 7th, we will be offering some one-on-one -on -one, uh, group sessions with Dee Dee and some one-on-one -on -one private sessions with Dee Dee. So it just depends on how much room I still have left. So if you go to our myfavoritegroomer.com slash shop, just hover over the shop icon and go to business services, uh, you'll be able to book it there. But I, I really, it's such a one-on-one. -on -one. If you want that one hour with me, I would prefer you um, call me or text me or email me and say, hey, Didi, how do I book this one-on-one? -on -one? And we will get on the phone and actually reserve you your slot. There will be a couple ways that you can uh, reserve your slots. So get me on the phone. Uh, go to myfavoritegroomer.com, get the number there, give me a call, text me or email me, and I will call you back in a um, decent hour. But we are going to have some one-on-one -on -one, um, times available. Some of them are going to be on group sessions. It depends on the price that you're going to come out there for. But come with your questions. Uh, a lot of you are learning how to groom. A lot of you are grooming already. A lot of you have this list of questions you've emailed me. If you want me to talk to you about it face-to-face, -face, I'm offering my time. So let me know. And um, if you want to be a part of the, the group that's uh, hanging out together in uh, Vegas during that time frame, if you happen to be going to Vegas for that same time frame, the 25th of June through the 28th-ish, right around there, let me know. We'll all get the same t-shirts. So if you want to represent my favorite groomer or uh, the dog up stand, please let me know. I'm going to have some t-shirts ready so that you can uh, order them. You've got to order them. Probably it takes a week and a half to get the t-shirts. So if you are interested in getting the t-shirts so we can all, don't you all love that feeling like when we were at Pasadena and we all had the same shirt? I, I know I did. The A group of people that we believe that the same thing, we all see the same way, and uh, we just are a part of that same, something identifying us as that same, uh, the same feeling of just love and adoration, and we just, I just, I just loved that. So if you guys wanna wear a shirt, let me know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start building my t-shirt now, and the link will be on my email. So if you email me or write me, then I, I'll get it to you. Even, in, and those of you, there were so many of you that did not go to Pasadena and you still bought a shirt and you wore it the day, the days that we were at Pasadena in your home. And I, I can't say thank you enough for that. Just know that we, the bond is there, the love is there, and I appreciate you all so much. Uh, thanks for supporting me and David. And thanks for doing everything you do for us, supporting us, um, shopping with us, sharing us. Those of you who don't have a pet, if you are in the Vegas area, um, by all means, I still want to meet you. So reach out. Um, they'll th Keep in touch because I don't know that I will post a lot about the Vegas trip. But if you want to meet, if you, I, there's something that I'm going to do. There, there's going to be some, uh, some group activities that we'll do or at least one major group dinner or something like that. I would love to just be in the same room as you. Um, I care about you all so much and you are... Um, the reason I'm here. So if you are interested in that, please, please, by all means, shoot out an email, a text, or get, just get a hold of me. You will not be invited if I do not hear from you. So I'm not going to publicize where I'm going to be, where, where, what we're doing to the world, because it is just definitely um, something I want to, it, like, you know, your little family, you want to keep them close and with love and care about people. So I will be... Um, Letting you know, if you directly contact me, you I uh, will let you know what we're doing. So I need to know who you are, that type of thing. I want to keep everyone safe, uh, as safe as I can, okay? In my care, that is. If you're going to hang out with me, I want to do the best I can, to, to just like I do with the animals. Uh, do the best I can for you guys um, so that we can all share and uh, in a... You have to have, if you're watching me, you can't be a hate talker. You can't be a negative, negative person. You have to be open, willing to learn. Uh, you have to be less judging. I know you all know who I'm talking about because the calls that I get that people really care about other people or learn, want to learn for themselves or want to learn for their own dogs or want to learn for their own business uh, who are uplifting, who are positive, who don't talk shit behind your back um, as another groomer, who really stand up for the right of the animal or the best that you can see someone doing. They're, those type of people, We all, if we're all in the same 
way of thinking. Um, that's you, you know who I'm talking about because you re you have reached out to me and I have helped you and we have made so much stride and we're talking hundreds and thousands of people that I have touched uh, and helped personally and not not to mention all the ones that have never called who have never needed my help but have found uh, the YouTube videos so helpful in their own world. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for being on uh, emailing me your stories. I really appreciate them and I do take them to heart and I, I make a connection with each and every one of you that does reach out. Uh, it may take me a month or two to get to you if you are only doing it through YouTube. And one day when there's millions and millions of comments, I may not be able to really touch base with you. So please, by all means, if you have a, a real question, if you have a question about your tools, about your pets, if you need my opinion, you've got to email me. Like you've got to take it to an email level, okay? to get a fast response. And it may be just the facts of things or my opinions written out. It may not be a very long detailed thing because I'm just doing a lot for many people. Um, but anyways, let's go back. If you want to meet with me, if you want to have a one-on-one, -on -one, uh, they are on my business services page on my website, myfavoritegroomer.com slash shop under business services. You can book it there. I would prefer you save a few bucks if you book it with me directly. So you'll have to call me or email me or text me and then I will send you an app. You can pay through the app and then we can definitely set up a time, either a private or a group session. It is very going to be small groups of people meeting. I don't plan on doing huge groups, a few small groups each night. And if the private one-on-ones take over, well, then they take over. So make your call and make your booking quickly. And David will probably load this as soon as possible so that y'all that are going to be in Las Vegas during that time frame can actually book it. One last thing I'd like to ask out there is if you're watching and you're a groomer and you have a salon in Las Vegas, I really want to talk to you. If you have a, maybe if you don't even have a salon, but if you have that aggressive dog, uh, a salon would be a better place to do this. But if you have that aggressive dog in Las Vegas, please reach out to me. Um, we can use that situation for training in one of our groups, excuse me, excuse me, I burped, group sessions. But um, if I can help you while I'm out there, I, by all means, I would love to uh, connect with you. So if, if that's you, you're like, oh my gosh, my dog is so aggressive or so hard to groom. I can't figure it out, you know, um, things like that. Uh, give me a call, okay? And we will talk. If you have a salon and you are watching me and you are a fan and you uh, think the same way I do as a groomer and and you get what I'm saying and the work that I do, then call me. Uh, my number is on the website at myfavoritegroomer.com. And uh, again, if you come to these group sessions, I am looking for, you know who I'm looking for, the people who love, have care, um, who are not negative and... Uh, it will support others and you come with questions and you come with the open-mindedness that each of us, including myself, we are, we don't know everything. And there's way more ways to do one thing than there is my way. So if you come with an open mind, sharing, no judging, judging means like, Oh, you're ugly or you're fat or I hate you or, uh, I don't like the way you do that. Screw you. No, that's not the way I function. That's not the way I think. I'm very direct, truthful, firm, loving, and I will be there for you when you need. I'm the, like that friend that you've always wanted, right? The one that's never going to let you down. Uh, I don't turn on my back on you and talk shit about you. I may use your situation as an example to someone just like you, but it's always good to know that you have someone, whether it's another groomer that you can call that won't judge you and hate on you, that will answer some questions you might have. And I may not even have all the answers, but at least you can... Sit down at a round table and chit chat about how you should do something better and how you should approach something. That's how you should come across with other people, other groomers, other human beings in life. So if you are interested in booking with me, please uh, give us a call, give us a, and you know, shoot out an email, but thank you so much. You all, you mean so much to me and I'm just so grateful to be able to help each and every one of you. So we'll talk to you later. Please book.